Hello everybody, hello, hello, and thank you very much for watching my channel on YouTube and Twitch. This is Night Tom, not your typical old man. I am not Tom from New York, although I would not have any problem right now to have a lot of money, hit the lottery or something like that, uh, go back to the United States, New York, get a house or whatever, and change my name to Tom. I won't have any problem with that. So it would mean two things. I will be Tom from New York, which most people call me that, Tom, NY Tom, which is not NY Tom, it's Night Tom. And the actual meaning is not your typical old man. One of my friends uh, from California, OP Destroy, uh, uh, plays the uh, Boom Beach uh, mobile gaming. He mentioned many years ago, when I said, I'm an old man, and he said, you're not typical old man. I was like, oh, that's a nice name. Let's use that. <laughs> Never thought about New York Tom. Somebody told me New York Tom. I said, wait, that makes sense, NY Tom, but it's not. It's Night Tom, not your typical old man. Um, age of uh, just, just actually 59. Next year is going to be 60. Not that old. They said 60 is a new 20. Well, it's not uh, physical. After, I think, what, 40 or 50 or something like that, even though your physical body goes, you know, forward, wrinkles, the gray and all that stuff, your mind goes backwards. So that makes sense. 60, new 20 or new 30, whatever, you go backwards. So when you get 80 and 90, you're going to be like newborn. I mean, somebody else will be feeding you, <laughs> changing your diapers. Hopefully not, but uh, you know what I mean. I moved from United States um, this year, actually, March. Uh, not even one year yet. And since I moved, since March, I'm drinking. Do you want to know what I drink? I will show you, by the way. What do you drink in, uh, in Turkey? What is the most uh, famous things? I'm not going to show you the most popular drinks, but I will tell you about it, and I will show you what I actually drink. Now... We drink coffee, obviously, we drink tea. I just found out last year, I just found out world's most tea drinking country. You can actually Google that because that's that's what I did, I guess. Most tea drinking country is Turkey. I, I did not know that I would I would go China. I would say Chinese people drink more tea, but that's not that's not the case. We drink tea. Uh, it is our uh, entertainment, <laughs> basically. Dessert, entertainment, whatever. We, we, we drink tea all over the place. But the cups are this tall. Very small. That's why when we drink, we drink 50 of them a day. <laughs> coffee. Coffee is very interesting. Actually, you probably saw some coffee grinding machines all over the place. In the United States, in Europe, whatever. Uh, they grind the uh, coffee beans into different levels. I don't know. South African, Brazil, whatever you know you have. All the way to the end, the last option for you to uh, grain the coffee bean says Turkish. <laughs> if you don't believe me, you can go check it out. Some of the, I think Walmart has it, or some, some of the food stores, you know, grocery stores. Turkish grinding. What, the, what it does is uh, when you grind the coffee beans to Turkish style, it actually comes out as dust. Turkish coffee grind, you know, the, the, uh, the coffees, we don't, we don't actually filter them. We don't have filters for it. In the United States, I always, you know, filter coffee machines, you know, you filter them, uh, even though cups or whatever you use. In Turkey here, we don't. You boil the water, you pour the coffee dust into water, mix it just like you're doing sugar. So you actually, when you drink, you're actually drinking the full coffee beans, not the uh, drained uh, filtered version. That's why the, uh, the coffee cups, are half of this like this turkish coffee cups half of this like this okay this is considered large in in turkey and well this is like a european or any other normal people will drink in everywhere else and in turkey half of this drink coffee i don't have the uh, regular uh, turkish coffee cups that's what i'm showing you i don't have the tea cups either uh, you know the glass I don't have that either, so. Um, but, here's my cup. 
That is how I drink my coffee and my tea. This is normal people drinks, you know. So I'm like a, it's like a soup cup, but it's not. It's actually drinking, you know. It's a normal uh, coffee cup. So what I put in there, well, in, in the United States, I used to do the, um, you know, uh, filtering coffee. Here, instant coffee. I use this one, Jacob's. It's the cheapest one I have right now around here, and it's very good. It's like a Nestle. Um, so this is my coffee, regular coffee, instant instant coffee. As tea, even though you buy teas uh, like, uh, you know, in a, in a, in a uh, can or whatever, and you filter and whatever. Not filter them, but there's a different way to do it here. Um, I use the uh, tea bags. This one here. That is a tea bag per cup, just like uh, everywhere else. It's called uh, black tea. Yep. And I'm addicted these days, literally, to two other drinks. They are both nice cafes. Okay. One is mocha. It is very nice. This is really, really tasty. And the other one is, you're not gonna believe, again, Nescafe, cappuccino. <laughs> I have boxes of those at home, and I drink those. Now you know what I drink. 